I'm delighted that we are celebrating the 75th anniversary of HMT Windrush. As a member of the Windrush generation, I pay huge tribute to the men, women who answered the call of the mother country and prepared a home for me and my brother to arrive. These pioneers wave goodbye to their home, families and loved ones to make the journey into the unknown. And contrary to what they were told, they were met with hostility, racism and rejection. I know my parents and friends that were, they were shocked and devastated by what they saw when they arrived. But their strength, resilience compelled them to persevere and we are thankful for their contribution to all aspects of British society. The nation's Wing Rush monument was designed to acknowledge and celebrate the outstanding contribution and dedication of the Wing Rush generation to the British history. The monument symbolises the courage, commitment, resilience of the thousands of men, women and children who travelled to the United Kingdom from 1948 1971. And they arrived at Tilbury with a huge amount of optimism. And then in the hours and the days and the weeks and the months and the years that followed, that optimism was replaced by an extraordinary sense of not being welcome and a sense of it all going wrong. They persevered and that's allowed us to be the country that we are today. It's allowed Darford to be the town it is today, it's allowed Kent to be the county that it is today. It's really important that we recognize their sacrifices and their contribution and how they didn't hesitate when they were called. We're pleased to be here in Darfur to celebrate the 75th anniversary of Windrush. This is something for future generations to learn from. Remember the fantastic contribution that has been made and without them we wouldn't be the country that we are today. To travel all of that way to come, those people worked, my parents worked hard, struggled, and gave us a better standard of living. We've, we've suffered also, but not to the extent that they did. The Windrush story is a story for all the time, uh, and wrongs are still happening today. So by learning from Windrush, I think we can develop a better understanding of what's going on in all parts of our community today. In school we learned about slavery, we didn't learn about Windrush, so, so if it wasn't for my mum, I wouldn't know about it, but now I do know that the younger generation, they're learning about it now, which is good. So the sacrifice they made in coming over and then compounded by the hostility is just phenomenal, yet the contribution has been so massive, it continues to be through their legacy. So for me, it's just about keeping that alive and being a part of it as part of the community.